What's up YouTube, Dimux here, and today we're going to be breaking down the teaser for Ant-Man and the Wasp. Yes, I know I'm late as f but better late than never, am I right? Like Hope says at the end of Ant-Man, It's about damn time. Finally we get to see the Wasp in action, but since this is the internet, some fans have ruined the moment by pointing out that Wasp's costume looks like... It looks like a dick. I can't unsee it! Curse you, internet! With that nonsense out of the way, let's get into the breakdown. Right off the bat, the trailer lets us know that Ant-Man and the Wasp takes place directly after the events of Civil War. However, it's still unclear if there will be any time jumps throughout the film because, thanks to some set photos, Ant-Man will appear in Infinity War, which is set after Ant-Man and the Wasp. Or maybe those set photos refer to Avengers 4, we'll just have to wait and see. Next we have Scott Lang who looks to be on house arrest under the authority of the FBI, seeing that Scott has to answer for his crimes and helping out Captain America. Does anyone have any orange slices? Maybe Tony Stark was able to pull some strings to allow for a more reasonable punishment so that Scott can be with his family rather than in a maximum security prison. But then again he didn't really care who he was so... I always said you never can trust a Stark. Who are you? <laughs> Then we have Hank and Hope Pym on the run from the government since Ant-Man has exposed himself to the world, prompting law enforcement to target the creator of Pym Particles. Then we see Hank Pym shrinking down a building to the size of a GameCube, which possibly contains his research on Pym Particles, so he might as well- Wait, whoa, 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 whoa! This building is equipped with handles and wheels? What? <laughs> then we get a glimpse of what seems to be a ship that will possibly be used for traveling into the Quantum Realm to save Janet Van Dyne, Hank's wife and Hope's mother, the original Wasp, who will be played by Michelle Pfeiffer. Meow. <laughs> Then we get a tease of what looks to be the main villain of the film, Ghost, played by Hannah John Common, and her abilities are based around stealth, whether it's invisibility, intangibility, and hacking electronics. So I'm guessing there will be a moment in the film where Ghost shuts down Ant-Man's suit thanks to her hacking abilities, and then uses her invisibility to sneak up on Ant-Man and BAM! Lights out. Plus we see Lawrence Fishburne switching sides from DC to Marvel, playing as Bill Foster, an old friend and assistant of Hank Pym, witnessing the transformation of Ghost. Hmm, I think I know where this is going. Who could possibly be his daughter, which could allude to a family rivalry subplot within the film. Also in the comics, Bill Foster's alter ego was Goliath, who had the ability to increase his size and mass like Ant-Man did in Civil War. Then we have Ant-Man riding on Anthony 2.0, then there's a cool car chase sequence with the Ant Van in action, and is able to use the pin particles to shrink to evade danger and comes in handy for surprise attacks. Then we have Ant-Man, or should I say Giant Man, hovering over a ferry boat, possibly going after Sonny Birch, played by Walton Goggins, and from the looks of it he has stolen Hank's building. Man, I never thought I'd say that in a sentence. Only an Ant-Man. Ants! Ants! What the- then we get a glimpse of Michael Pena running into action and was probably the person who was driving that Hot Wheels car. Dude, I'm getting Green Lantern flashbacks. Then we get to see some Wasp action of her dodging some knives and showing off her stingers, which is what I really appreciate about the Ant-Man movies because they find creative ways to use the shrieking ability in combat. And finally, what's an Ant-Man movie without using child product placement as a weapon, am I right? So let me just guys think in the comments down below about this teaser trailer for Ant-Man and the Wasp. Are you guys excited for this film? Well, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button. It really helps me out. Subscribe for more content from me on Ant-Man and the Wasp and other films in general. I'm Dimalex. Us in the future.